Hi and welcome to the channel. Today I have some very exciting news for you. Uh, okay, I really don't know if it's super exciting for you, but it has been for me. It has been something that I've been waiting for for a very, very long time. It feels like a very long time, but, but um, it really didn't uh, took that long time. What I'm talking about is the adapter plugs for my Heidenheim DRO digital readout, which are mounted on my Intos milling machine. And the Heidenheim system is a great system, but it's just 30 years old almost. So it lacks some options which I like. So instead I bought the Icon A30, like I have on the bridge port and my micro Riley lays, uh, and would replace all the scales as well but as they are built in in the knee and on the side um, I really didn't want to change them um, if I could if I if I could somehow get an option and then I contacted Icon from Icon and I talked about uh, my issues and after a while, we uh, we came up with an, an idea where I shipped him a Heidenheim scale. I have a spare one, and then they would take a closer look at it and maybe come up with an adapter so I could use my Heidenheim scales on the Icon A30 display. And it's here. Finally, it's here. I know it's only a little uh, thing, but but it's something that has kept me from using the mill as much as I really wanted. I really love the Intos or the tool room mill in general. It's a very strong, uh, precise and rigid machine, but it was uh, yeah, a pain in the ass to use because of the DRO. Because I really like yeah, a good half or center finding option and a bolt pattern option. And the Heidenheim didn't have that, but the Icon has some very good features. So uh, I will talk more about that later. But now the adapter are here in my hand. And I'm at the moment currently uh, about to exchange the, the display. As you can see here, it's only to screw down the adapter in the old Heidenheim plug. And plug it into the DRO display and then it's, it's ready to go. So it's very nice finally having a, a good digital readout on the mill and then I can use the mill more. So if any of you have the same scales from Heidenheim and you want a way way better and way 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 cheaper readout I can highly recommend you to give Icon, Icon a, a mail on Instagram, on email or yeah, any social media and talk about the, the issues you have and I'm sure he will sell you a pair of this. If I have had to buy a Heidenheim display which isn't as easy to use as this, I would pay 10 or 15 times as much as this display costs. They are extremely expensive. And yes, they are very good quality. But again, this is a hobby shop. I'm on a budget. And it's more than accurate from what I can use. And it's sufficient, if I can say so. And I'm pretty sure for 99.99 percent of, of most machinists with manual machines it's more than enough so don't waste your money on super expensive equipment buy more buy cheaper <laughs> but now i will continue to mount them there's really not m much to do everyone can do this so uh, it, it just just plugging in the adapter and then you're ready to go but i will show you some more and then i will get back
then I'm back and the installation is done calling it a installation is maybe a little bit too much because it's only uh, a matter of remove the old and mount the new and in this case it was easy to just remove the four bolts remove the cover um, unscrew the old and drill a new hole for the, for the icon and then mount it all back again back again and of course mount the adapters and mount the adapters to the grow display and then it's ready to uh, to move And I've checked it with a dial indicator several times in the movement the dial had, and it it uh, it's within uh, it's more accurate than the 100th millimeter dial can uh, can show. So it's more than enough for me. As mentioned, what I really like about this draw is the half function on the bolt circle pattern. I have some other videos where I show some more in depth uh, about it. But let's say we have a center fix or a edge finder, 3D test, tester, um, or anything you can trust where you will, if this is a part, you will, you will um, touch off on one side and go to the other. And let's assume we uh, touch off on the one side and the Y, then we will go over to the other side. And let's say it's uh, 17 point like this. And this is not a number I can, with my little brain, calculate. So instead I will mark the axis and press the half button. And then I will just have to move the axis, axis back to the red dot uh, to the two arrows or the zero mark and then I will be in the perfect middle and if you do that on X and Y if you're using it uh, a normal setup with the vertical head then you will use the X and Y and then we assume we are in the perfect middle now then I will enter the bolt circle Move downwards. I will have a diameter of 80 millimeter. I will. I can add where I will start and where I will end, and you know have different bolt circles. But I will have eight holes, and then I simply press enter, and then it will tell me where the center or the tool is, and where the first hole will be, and then I can move around and simply lay out all the holes, super easy and super accurate. If you follow me on this channel, you will see I use this also at my work on the cast new lathe I'm uh, using on a daily basis, our Bridgeport mill, our Java mill, a Spanish made one, and our French Juan mill, and also our Just Horizontal Boring Machine, HBM. Sorry for the bad English. Um, we use it on most of our machines and they are super accurate and they from from the daily use in one shift in a repair shop they seem to last very good of course I can't tell you how it will perform in 10 20 years and so but I see good expensive system fail so every manufacturer every uh, brand has something that isn't super good therefore i would recommend you to buy this i'm not sponsored or anything like, like that it's my honest personal opinion i would recommend you buy similar system or this system over a very expensive that costs five or ten times as much 
because they will also wear and they will also fail. If you buy something like this, you will have money in your pocket so you can go out and buy another set or you can maybe expand and buy on your lathe or whatever machine you, you have where you can afford it. This one is, I would say, the best money can buy at this moment uh, when we talk digital readout. And also from the guys in China, Aiken and his friends and colleagues, they are super, super helpful and they will do the best job to no matter what problem you have, they will help you. And also you can find a lot of support online from all the users as well. Instagram and Facebook, they have a lot of users of this spread as well. So enough about that. Um, overall, I'm very, very, very happy that I got this little upgrade. Um, it will make the mill way, way more useful for me. Um, and as you can see, it's a super, super nice, almost, almost like new. Um, and getting a new and better digital readout, I will uh, have much more use of it and much more fun of it. Uh, you can see the old readout, if you can't, can't remember it, it's an old Heidenheim. And it's a good system. It's, it's not about that, but it's how you... Uh, it's, it's, it's features and how you use the features. As you saw in the video, I could very quickly find a center of a part. Here I have to press, I, I can't even remember how to use it. I have to stand with the manual in my hand because I use it so rarely <laughs> because it is so stupid. But I think it's six, five or six buttons, presses I need to perform just to find the center. And Almost every time I did something wrong, so I could start all over again. The other one, it, it just work. It never fails. Um, also, when when we have the boat circle, boat pattern option, it will show you always where you are on the screen and which hole you are at. I have used many rows where there wasn't a, a visual or graphic that shows it. And of course you can use it, but you have to remember all the numbers. It, 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 it's way easier the other way around. And people like me who are stupid, they get a lot of help from that. So I can highly recommend it. Now this is a, a, not a latest version, but it's a newer version of the height and high scales. The older one will way bigger. I don't know if it will work. You have to talk to Icon or the guys from Icon and they know hopefully something about it else you can find some info online on uh, Heidenheim or um, I think there were some uh, forums and so it's about the resolution and how they talk to the unit but this one as you can see worked perfectly with this so I think that's about what I can and have to say about this little upgrade. For me, it feels like I'm getting a, a new meal. I'm very, very excited. So, thank you for watching. I hope my English wasn't too bad and uh, it wasn't a pain to see and listen to. Have a nice day. Please subscribe and like my videos. It will help me a lot. Bye bye.